Hello guys, this is Carlin Garden Tips and Tutorials. And for today's video, I wanted to talk to you about Caladium. And if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please click the subscribe button for more tips and tutorials. Caladium have been popular houseplants for decades, and lately, caladiums got more and more attention. Caladiums are plants that are native to South and Central America, and they are known in their colorful leaves that are heart-shaped. They are also called angel wings, elephant ears, and heart of Jesus. And here in the Philippines, we also called it Gabi Gabi plant. There are two main types of caladium, the fancy leaf and strap leaf caladiums. The fancy leaf caladiums are heart-shaped or semi-heart-shaped leaves, while the strap leaf caladiums are narrow leaves or ruffled leaves. Because caladium have thin leaves and they are light sensitive, so plant them only on partial filtered sunlight, also plant them in the place that they will not affected by wind because too much wind can damage their leaves. Also, caladium thrive in moist, well-drained soil, and they need to be watered regularly. So, ito guys, based on my own experience, mas dumadami sila kapag medyo malamig-lamig yung soil na pinagtatam na nila. Pero ayaw din ng caladium na parang putik na ang kanyang soil, kaya dapat well-drained soil din yung gamitin natin. Tips number 3 guys, use the water that you rinse in rice as your organic fertilizer. It will help your caladium to have more babies and to be more verdurous or leafy. And I highly recommend this guys, proven and tested and you don't need to buy any fertilizer. You can clearly see the results guys sa mga caladium na ito. Since yung dinidilig ko talaga sa kanila is yung pinaghugasan ng bigas.
for watching. When we reach our 100 subscribers, we will have a plant giveaway. So if you want a free plant, be one of my subscribers.